The situation in the Red Sea is escalating every day. In the recent attack, a container ship, Maersk Hangzhou, which was in the southern Red Sea, was attacked in an apparent bid to hijack the ship. Four small boats surrounded uh, the ship and uh, the crew fired upon the vessel. And they also tried to board the ship. But the security which was on the ship, they also returned the fire. Meanwhile, the ship sent out a distress signal which was received by US warships in the area. They dispatched uh, helicopters uh, to safeguard the ship. When the verbal call was given by these helicopters to the crew uh, of small boats to back off, they did not listen to it but fired on the US Navy helicopters. In the return fire, the crew of uh, three boats uh, were killed and three bo boats uh, were sunk one boat managed to escape. Now, the same ship had sent out a distress signal few hours back. Uh, it was hit by an uh, anti-ship uh, uh, ballistic missile. It had sent out a distress signal which was uh, again responded to by US warships and it had intercepted two other uh, ballistic missiles in the area and US has launched uh, Operation Prosperity Guardian to safeguard the ships in the area but the attacks continue uh, every day. Now, this was uh, at least uh, 24th attack in the same area since it started on November 19th when Galaxy leader, uh, uh, again another container ship was hijacked by Houthi rebels. In the meanwhile, the UK foreign minister has talked to his counterpart in Iran and he has also said that this cannot go on and this needs to stop. But Houthi rebels are continuously attacking ships in the area and several countries have stepped up their patrols in the area, including India. In New Delhi, Kadhan Bini Sharma for NDTV.